All right, guys. So I just lost my A rig right over here. <clears throat> my I lost my A rig right over here. You see this here? Star Bright Extend Brush. Okay. So it goes to about like I don't know, ten feet. It extends out ten feet. I winded up putting these chains on here. Okay, I drilled like a 316 hole and I put these chains on there so I can get my lure back if it's within reasonable, you know, it, you know, reasonable reach. So let's we'll see if I can get the A rig back. Alright, so I got the A rig back with the extender brush. So I got it back with the hook. You see that hook there? That's how I got it back. I didn't get it with the chains, but sometimes the chains will hook the hooks and you'll get it back. But I actually winded winded up getting it back with this little hook here. And the line broke at, it didn't break at the knot. It broke above the knot. Can you see this? You see that line? So the knot's still there. Give me a second. All right, so I always tie a uni knot, and it's a, it's a very good knot. So the knot didn't break. like it got got wrapped up in here somehow and that's what broke it so it got wedged it got wedged in between here when I threw it out there I let it probably let it sink and the line got wrapped in here and wedged in here and that's what broke it So we got it back with the extender brush. You guys out there when you bank fish, especially in a river, pick up one of these brushes. Like I said, it extends to about 10 feet, right? Drill a little hole in that, like a 3 16 hole, right? And put a couple little chains on there. I got these chains from Amazon. Nothing heavy duty, just, you know, you know, a decent stainless steel uh, chain link. And, uh, you know, you'll be able to grab the hooks of your lure if you can't get it with the hook. But this this is the name of the company. It's uh, Star Bright Extended Brush. It's pretty good. It'll definitely save you money.